In the centre of Tapachula, on Mexico's southern border, a new set of businesses have popped up over the past two years. Yeah. Haitian barbershops. Sonny Busquet, who has been in Tapachula for 18 months, says for his recently established community, such businesses are essential. We're mixing the Haitian culture with Mexican culture. It's becoming a mix. It's a way for our community to survive here. If we can't find work in the town, we establish our own businesses. Officials here say the first large influx of Haitians came in July 2019 when a migrant caravan was prevented from moving farther north into Mexico. Since that group of migrants decided to settle here, their population has exploded. Local authorities estimate the Haitian community now numbers some 40,000 people here, making Tapachula one of the world's primary destinations for Haitians outside of Haiti itself. And while many migrants from other countries simply see Tapachula as a stopping point on the migrant route north, a large proportion of this community has settled here for good. For some of the local Mexican population, the sudden arrival of so many migrants has been a shock. I have never seen any Haitian doing anything wrong. They are peaceful and very hardworking, but the government should allow them to continue on their route north because our city is now extremely crowded. That crowding is most obvious where the more transitory Haitian migrants are living, in the parking lot of the town's football stadium. Conditions here are difficult, as the migrants wait for authorities to take them to other parts of the country. I've been here for 22 days. We suffer under the hot sun. There's no food or water. There are pregnant women and young children. All we want to do is work and earn money, but that's not allowed. As Tapachula's Haitian population grows, those who want to stay must integrate with Mexican society. And for those who don't, desperation and pressure builds to the formation of a migrant caravan and a mass push northward. Alastair Bavastok, CGTN, Tapachula, Mexico.